Oh, 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 O-R-E-O, my God. Yes, this is the 90s hip hop and rap relived in a card game. Okay, so <laughs> the old coot here coming at you with another exciting video. These are two great card games. This is 90s R&B edition, right? Lyric legend, music trivia card game. And then here you have 90s rap and hip hop. Oh, my God. <laughs> <laughs> all these songs just came rushing back to me and i was like i've been craving this for the longest time what a crowd pleaser especially if you're from that generation like if you were in high school college maybe after college maybe even 30s 40s during that time frame in the 1990s even a teenager i mean this thing is multi-generational you will love this game especially when Friends come over, maybe family comes over, maybe you go to, I'm, I'm just going to say it. Let's say you go on a blind date and you're like, hey, wait a second, we're around the same age. Do you remember? Blah, blah, blah. And it's just, it's fun. It's engaging. It's entertaining. It'll get you to sing along with a lot of the songs that you remember from back in the day. Love this. Absolutely <laughs> love this. Right off the bat, when I open up the packages, the first thing, and these are two separate packages, by the way, I, I will put links down below in the description so you can go ahead and check those out. But right off the way, when I open up the packages, what I love the most is that you have two separate compartments, right? And you have like twice as many cards or whatever. But as you play the game, you can go from one side to the other side. That way, you know that you've already asked those questions or whatever. And then catch this, as you're flipping through the cards, right? All the rules and instructions, right? How to play, you can scan the QR code, right? Which is where you get that right there. In this game, you're only as good as your word. <laughs> Awesome. So there's the there's the backside of water right there. There's kind of like the player most recently sang a song out loud starts the game. And then you get that part. And then I'll let you take your screenshot. I'm not going to read all this. But basically, as you're flipping through the cards, right, and you do want to shuffle them up, boom, you get this like steel thing here where you can actually go ahead and, you know, do that whole spiel and steal, you know, from a player or whatever that might be. Play it in teams. You know, if you want to do like teams of two, teams of three, whatever, I mean, the fun never stops. So depending on how many people you have, what a great idea. Also, if you're doing this at like a community hall, right? Let's say you get enough people together where there's like 50 people playing. What you can always do is you can have just somebody like every, like you have like a spotter, somebody raises their hand and they get to answer the question first. So you can play as an individual or you can play as a team or you can play as a group. It's just the sky's the limit. I mean, it's just ridiculous how awesome this is. Let me show you the actual, like some of the questions here. So like I like in happy by Ashanti, there you go. You know, what has she been searching for? Boom. And then there's your answer at the bottom. So that's kind of cool. So basically what would happen is, is you would like, let's say these were all in the stack. You'd basically pull a card, right? And you're asking the question to the other team or whatever the case may be. You flip the card over and then you ask your question. And every little step by Bobby Brown, who will be there every little step I take? And then there's your options, right? A, I will be, you will, she, C, she will, D, they will. And obviously, ding, 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 ding. You will be there. There's my cheap attempt at singing, but you get the idea. What a great combination of questions, right? So this happens to be the 90s R&B version. And then on this side of the coin, I opened up the 90s rap and hip hop version. So let's take, for instance, like, I wish by Skilo, right? How tall does he wish he was? And there's your option. So A, six foot six, B, six foot nine, C, six, three, or D, seven feet tall. And then boom, the answer is six foot nine. Quick little side note, trivia. This is trivia within the trivia. This is something I know personally because I actually met him in person. Yes, I met the man, the myth, the legend in person. He was working as a security guard in the Miracle Mile, believe it or not, for a pretty upscale corporate company. I was, I happened to be in that neighborhood and I was walking by. I was like, wait a second, aren't you the dude? And he's like, yeah, we took some pictures. What a great guy. What a really great guy. He, he had a good, like love life, very positive. But anyways, there's a, there's a good side note for you. Anyways, back to the games, right? So you can buy one, or you can buy both. You know, if you really want to go nuts, you can mix them all up and then just have a combination of R&B and rap and hip hop. If you decide to mix them up, you know, just shuffle between the decks or whatever you want to do. 
anyways, great little idea, great game. What a like I said, what a crowd pleaser for fun and engaging, and entertaining. Guys, specifically guys, if you're dating a girl and you want to impress her, you want to show her that you care about her, this is a great game to play because women love, absolutely love being entertained and they want to play these types of games that they can feel successful at and, and win something. And there's a throw some, you know, throw some variety into the mix. Maybe one night you play this game and then, you know, somebody gets a kiss or whatever. Just saying, just saying, if you want to go all out. Anyways, kudos to Lyric Legend. There are so many other games that they have, and I will put links down below there in the description, so make sure to check those out. But what a what a fun idea. I mean, because it, it makes you think. You know, it's not just like a right-off-the-bat answer. It makes you think. It helps you to just engage your friends, your family, whoever you decide to play this with or whatever the case may be. But what a great, great, great idea. You know, girls, if you're going to have a girls' night and you want to do this and just relive your 90s, you know, do, do it do it to the extreme whatever the expression is but you can definitely have fun with this you can also i'm not endorsing this in any way but you you know where i'm going with this you could turn this into a drinking game if you decided to do that i'm not endorsing that in any way shape or form but just saying that is also an option you know miss the question take a shot whatever kids like if the kids want to get involved and they remember this era and they've been listening to that song because hey if your parents right you're going to be playing this music in your car or whatever at home your kids are listening along they might even they might even you know stimulate their mental capacity and all that good stuff and just anything that's active and engaging just saying it's a way to go anyways links will be down there below in the description loving <laughs> freaking camping this is definitely coming with me on my next camping backpacking trip because we're usually around like the same age group, maybe, you know, plus or minus 30 years or so, but definitely within that era. And like I said, there are other games and options available from the same company. What a great company. So you can kind of pick and choose what you like and mix and match and all that good stuff. So links will be down there below in the description. Make sure to check that out. Definitely hit that like button, hit the subscribe button if you like what you're seeing. I'm the old coot and I will catch you all in the next exciting video.